okay what is going on everybody and welcome back to part two we are literally right where we left off i didn't go anywhere in fact i was just recording about five minutes ago so you guys didn't miss a thing i got up walked around that was about it so here we go <laughs> we are heading into the monolith once inside we won't be coming out until macros is finished we will arrive in the earth realm the lowest level of the monolith interior. Macros has learned how he can use the monolith to become a god. It is an ancient spell, the rites of ascension. This spell can be broken, but only if we know it ourselves. A copy of the rites of ascension are stored here in the earth realm, guarded by Macros's men. You must go to their base and seize the rights for yourself. Bring them to me, and I will find a way to break the spell. Okay, easy enough. How do I get out of here? Oh. Okay. Alright. This is the Earth Realm, where our adventure begins. Point me towards this watchtower. I'll guide you on your path, but keep your sword close. You'll find no friends here. okay we got the new suit we doing work let's go this is gonna be great all right let's see what's this give me this okay got some infused jasper i'll take that all day long i believe that's needed to craft those suits so i'm definitely gonna take that i got a little bit of info when it comes to this one but not a lot i've been trying to pick up the pieces and try to figure out what exactly is happening but i know one thing it looks beautiful and it plays very very well so we're definitely moving through this this is going to be a really good series and i'm really enjoying the combat so far so we're moving right along i appreciate you guys taking the time to watch and have some fun with me and roll out as i destroy these wonderful vases you know they got some money in them i know one of y'all got some money in y'all <laughs> yes Let's go. Come here. Yeah, you didn't know what was going on, did you? These twilight beacons mark places where we can start future missions. Let's activate as many of these as we can. Okay. Okay. So she said future missions. So more than likely, we're going to be coming back here. So. All right. More than likely, if there's any grinding, I'll probably do it um, prior to recording. Just so you guys don't, you know, see me going up against the same people. I kind of want to get through the story. Nice. This hammer is beautiful, too. My man with the gun. I saw you shooting at me. Yeah, that was nice. But yeah, I'll probably grind it out, um, you know, before I actually start recording or anything. If anything needs to happen like that, you know, to get the suits, to get all the extra stuff. I'll probably make it happen. If it's anything noteworthy, obviously, I'll turn the camera on, I'll turn everything on, and uh, record it and document it for you guys. But otherwise, ain't no big deal. Oh, yes, there's our friend. Come on. Yeah, come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, you don't want none of this. He definitely does want some of this. <laughs> oh, oh. I love how he's like basically just a tank like he just eats hits like it's nothing oh man we're gun put him out first now i can deal with y'all there we go i like how the flash actually stunned the other guy too that's cool 
Yeah, somebody put some love into this. I like this. Somebody put some love into this. I, I can appreciate that as well. Yeah, and I can see the multiple paths. I'm definitely going to have to come back through here. What's this? Oh, okay, I see. I understand. You see it's like pointing you in a direction of where they are. So it's like right here. And oh, it's another one over there. Uh, shield? Yep. There we go. Nice, nice. And I broke the vase. I'll take that. I will definitely take that. All right, give me this. Okay. How do I get to the watch tower? What's over there? There's something over here. Oh, it's a chest. Okay, I'll take that. I love that, by the way. That that jumping thing is teleporting. Whatever I'm, it's really really cool. I really like that. I love that the game seems like a technical, you know, like. It seems like it's a old but new like type of world, if that makes any sense. Like it's technologically advanced, but it's still like honor bound by the old ways and the honor and the the, the fighting and the battling with the swords and everything. You know, I, I actually like that. Go ahead and sit down, man. Think about what you've done. Let me get my prize. I actually really like that. We're about to level up again. All right, let me see skills and weak spots or weak points. I'll take that. Let's keep it moving. Okay. I hear the something. The tower is up ahead. Keep your hand on your sword. Okay. Let's see what y'all got. Man with gun, you already know what time it is. Take him out first. Oh, our friend is here. Oh, the protector's protecting the guy with the gun. <laughs> Good man. Oh, no more protector. Yeah, you gotta take this dude out too. Like, he's not playing. Oh, okay, okay, I see. Did you see the weak point? I like that. Look, yeah, you yeah, you just go ahead and lay down, man. Think about what you've done. What's over here? What's 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 over here? Anything? Oh, some vases. I'll take that. All right. Give me that. Nice. Okay. Wow, this game is so beautiful. It's it's really really nice. Anything to loot up here? All right, give me this. And. Check out these vases, these wonderful innocent vases. <laughs> and then we'll keep it pushing. Let's go up here, let's see. Oh, we got a nice little treasure chest, okay. Is on the upper level of the watchtower. Alright, I'm picking up some goodies. Alright, let's go. Our friend. Glad to see he lived as well. It's pretty. Last time I saw him, we was, you know, falling. I was punching you in the face. You don't remember that? I don't think he remembers that. That's okay. We'll make him remember. Ooh, this Warhammer is doing work. Oh, yes, he got me. Okay, you got it. See my slide? That's that upgrade. You got to upgrade. Getting better, getting stronger. Hit him in the head. <laughs> I love how different enemies also have the High Lord has teleported. What? He hasn't gone far. Track his name. Lead you to him. 
I was saying I love how each enemy has a different weak point. That's pretty cool. I actually really think that's really cool. Somebody really put some thought into that. That man ran from me though. We're gonna hunt him down. That's okay. Alright, come on. Let's go get him. Oh, same place. The man threw a smoke bomb and disappeared. Gotta kill his troop. Man with gun. Oh, he shot me. Oh, another man with a gun. Alright. Yes. Hit them weak points. Go put him out. Sit down. He's in the clearing. Get this green. He in the clearing. Let's go get him. Who's this down here? I think if I was in there, I'd be one of them with the guns. These swords is cool, but, you know, if I could just shoot you, what's the problem? <laughs> I wonder if your character can get one of those guns. That'd Hand be cool. If you want to live. This is for Macros alone. Macros has gone mad. Let's finish this. Oh, I shouldn't have got greedy. That's what I get. That hurt, didn't it? That's the only thing. That thing, the Warhammer is slow. Like, that's the thing. I can get multiple hits in on this guy. So it actually makes him not that hard. He's not that hard to fight. I kind of can bully him too, because if you think about it, he, he can't really. Now he hit you, it hurts, but otherwise, he can't really hit you. You see what I'm saying? He's slow. He got me there, though. <laughs> I was in the process of throwing the shield at him. I like that. But if he hit you, it's going to hurt. Yeah, oh, no. Oh, he just bodied me. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking all of that. Let me let me heal up. <laughs> that man grabbed me. I like that. I like that. I got health right there. Can I go get that? Did he just drink a potion? I ain't gonna help you. Come see me, man. Come on. Oh, yeah. He up out of here. Sit down. Let's go. Turned his weapon against them. Put him out. Let's see. What is this? Use the beacon, okay. I knew that was coming. <laughs> they look too good, I had to break them. Oh, what's up here? Hold on. What's this? Okay. Story mission complete. Return to Sanctum to continue your journey. Well done. We have the rites of ascension. I'll study this spell and learn its secrets. 
But I cannot fight Macros and his army. That job is yours, and yours alone. Are you ready to see what you are up against? Show me my enemies. Macros. He's not a god yet. Tell me how the rites of ascension work. In order to complete the rites, Macros will need to absorb a massive amount of Ethereum. I doubt he's gathering all of that energy on his own. Exactly. Each of his lieutenants is channeling elemental energies for him. They'll be his strongest allies. Without a doubt. But remember, when you defeat them, their strength will become your own. This is Zamora the Farseer. Her Vargul warriors hold the Earth Realm for Macros. She's a powerful sorcerer. She's an animal, fighting to survive. She's sealed herself in her lair behind the Prismatic Falls. You'll have to find a way to breach her defenses. Next, you'll face Zamora. It's in the Water Realm, drawing magical energy from beneath the surface. Lunara is a guardian construct. It won't be easy. Lunara is mindless, but still dangerous. Unfortunately, its participation in the rites has only made it more powerful. I recognize this one. Greaves Sunsteel. Greaves is a godsmith and a madman. He is responsible for arming most of Macros' elite warriors. He is also a master of fire magic. He only serves Macros because it benefits himself. Lastly, Gildan Commander, a true believer in Macros' right to become a god. He holds court in the Air Realm, forcing trials of combat on unwilling souls. I don't know this one. Macros sees him as your replacement. Killing his lieutenants isn't enough. I have to face him. Macros absorbs the Ethereum they send him. He believes he is already unstoppable. He's wrong. I'll stop him. Sure, we got some stiff competition. You sure about that? I think we got this. Let me see. Before I move forward, do I got anything to level up? Do I got anything to uh, add? Okay, no, not really. All of this stuff is weak. Oh, no. Uh, let's see. Do I got an amulet? I think I did get an amulet, didn't I? Vitality. Yeah, put this on. And then this um might okay so my, my girl gonna be strong or well, Orin. Orin's a guy i guess he's a girl guy one of them he's one of them <laughs> let's see life stones let's see let's see all right this that might have not have been the, the best one let me go look at this other one yeah let me get this one yes do i do i have any charms no do I have any banners? No. All right. And we're still level four, so we're doing pretty good. Let's talk to her. Let's see what she got. You are strong, Orin, but not strong enough to defeat Macros and all of his men. You must train. I found a man who can help. He is a godsmith of some renown who can help you craft and upgrade your gear. The Vargul are holding him captive on the other side of the Crimson Glades. Head to the Vargul stronghold, breach their defenses, and rescue this godsmith. Okay. Oh, we back. This is where it all started. Well liked by the Vargul. You, least of all. They will attack you in sight. I can't just walk away from this. Oh, yes. All right. Let's go see what we can do. Totems destroyed. Okay. Let's go destroy some totems. So each of these missions actually come with a recommended level. So I'm guessing at one point or another, it does get significantly harder to gain these levels or gain to advantage or because I'm just running through it right now but I have a feeling that that's going to be what it is he just put me on my butt wow nice 
yeah i'm guessing that that's gonna be you know what it is like eventually i, mean, I am gonna have to go and grind or maybe there's side quests or something that i can do to you know make my character significantly stronger yeah it's got to be something like that so we'll see though oh yes give me this yeah all right it still looks gorgeous look at the water look at the everything is just really nice in this game and it feels next gen that's the biggest thing for me it actually does feel like a next gen game you want some of this yeah you do yeah you do yeah you do you want some and you got some there you go oh he shot me jerk come see me there there you go there you go Those weak spots hit those weak spots. All right, one down, two to go. Totems are full of magic. Smash them, and that magic can be yours. I see where they get the term looter slasher from because there's a lot of treasure chests and there's a lot of loot in this game. Which isn't a bad thing. I actually kind of like that. And I, I think it works well. I don't think it's like forced or anything. I think it's in the game. It's actually really, really, really nice. Whoa. Okay. Gotta take you out. He didn't stand a chance. That weak point, break that. Give me this total. Two down, one to go. I wonder if there's a stat to, to measure how many uh, vases I've broken. I really would like to know. <laughs> I thought I blocked. By Felicia. Yes, sit down, baby. Oh, I missed the parry. Oh, I missed the parry. That's okay. Still got him. Let's go. Level up. We level five now. We doing work. You are always training, Arden. That's a good point. I like how she put that. Let's go ahead and level up real quick. Uh, weapon timing. I guess weapon timing. That'll be fine. Additional totems or the stronghold. I got a little spirit vision. There's something over there. I'll probably have to come back for it. I'm going to go ahead and just hit this... Uh, Objective real quick. Let's see where we at. Oh, he got me good. Come here. Put you out right now. Oh, healer. Oh, okay. I see. You got to go too. Nice. Got it. He's out of here. There's an Ethereum seal over the fortress gate. Tell me our options. I can shatter these magical barriers if we are able to gather enough power. Head to the base of the Prismatic Falls. There is a source of rich ethereal power we can use. 
you see what I see. I am housed within your valor plate. I can affect the world through you. Oh, that's cool. That's good to know. That the uh, Seventh Sanctum, she's actually with us in the armor, so she can actually see everything we do. That's cool. There we go. Get this, get this, get this. Ah, I meant to get out of the way. Thank you. Throw that back at him. Oh, he disappeared. I like that too. Come here. Didn't work, but I, I appreciate it. Destroy this. You know, this game got a little bit of uh, Warframe in it, too. It kind of got that feel to it as well. I... It's not a bad thing. Like, no, not at all. It feels good. I actually really like the way it feels. Put him out. Thank you. Almost there. Nice death blow. Way up out of here. Give me this loot. Okay. First, let me look around a little bit. I'm gonna break the seal. Can you see if I can get that? Got it. Let's get this over here, and then we're gonna head to the seal. Oh wait, it's one right there. Okay. Oh, the chest is right there too. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Hope I didn't waste anything important. <laughs> Let's open this up. Give me all these goodies. Alright, let's head back to that seal. We can break it down now. Be glad to see us. The blacksmiths are called the godsmiths. Like, that's got to be some sort of upgrade. Like, what are they building? Oh, you jerk. There we go. Thank you. Oh, wait, it's over here. I thought it was over there. All right, let's go up here. Bully that man. Whoa. Oh, 
Oh, uh, what? Where'd he go? Oh, right there. There we go. Come here. Got to get out of loot. A little something for my troubles. I think something's up there. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> Come on, baby. Dodge, you gotta dodge to the weapon side. Otherwise, otherwise you run right into it. Oh, he's summoning friends. Come on, man. Oh, they're trying to heal him up. Oh, he was stunned. Oh, man. No goonies for you. Got him. Come on. That's right. And we got the level up. Level six. We moving. We making moves out here. All right, let's go get our boy. But before we do that, let's go ahead and level up real quick. Okay. Let's get might. Um, do I want might or do I want takedowns? I kind of want takedowns. I'm going to take takedowns. If you guys ever wanted a breakdown of what all these skills actually do, let me know. And we'll take the time to read through all of them. But... Honestly, they're pretty self-explanatory. Thank the Archons. I thought I'd be stuck here. Wait. Oren? You're alive. Zenith, I didn't know it was you here. And I didn't know you were still alive. I'll take this as a sign. Perhaps we'll survive Matros's madness after all. Come. We have much to discuss. Are we going into a sanctum? Oh, Oren. So this is the inside of a sanctum. Hmm, she's quite something. Though I did not expect her to be so independent. She's a living being, Oren. Not merely some weapon to be wielded. Well, in that case, I'll have to look to you for the weapons. Ha! <laughs> you never change. I'll provide you with basic arms. The rest we can forge. Here, this will help. A sacred flame! Go on. Light the forge with it. Okay. You'll be able to upgrade your equipment once we gather the right materials. Nice. Okay, we're gonna make some upgrades. Okay. Alright, so this is where we're actually gonna cut it off. We're gonna stop it here because we are over the time. I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch. Do me that favor, like, subscribe, leave me a wonderful comment down below if you're enjoying this series. Any comments, obviously, any tips and tricks, also leave them down below. I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch, and I'll definitely see you on the next one.